Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell today, I am beat to the gods. <laughs> Take a look. Loving the ombre lip to match my nails. So today's video is all about what is in my makeup bag. My makeup bag. Makeup bag. It is the essentials into my beauty lifestyle to make me look like this. So everyone should always have an essential for your face. Do what you enjoy to put onto your face to make you beat for the gods. So in my own personal makeup bag, which I use all the time, you can see that like I, how I do my face, how I make myself look. This is what is in my bag. First, what I like to use on my face to get my skin prepped for the amount of makeup that we do put on as, you know, if you know, you're a drag queen, you're going on to a dinner day, you're just, you know, going to the fucking grocery store. You need a good primer. You need something that's going to keep your skin nice and tight so the makeup doesn't sink into your pores and then you break out and then you cry and then you just want to lay in bed and watch Netflix. Anyways, so... The Farsali Unicorn Essence. This is amazing. I'm ups I'm gonna bring it a little closer so you guys can you know check it out. I'm sure everyone who know you all know this, but you know what? I don't give a flying fuck because you're on my channel. So it's the Farsali Unicorn Essence. Can we see all that? I am obsessed. It is a beautiful, beautiful. Oh, the color is amazing. Look at that pink. Oh, look. Drip, drip, drippity drip. <laughs> Smells amazing and actually makes my face feel really great. I have been using this for about a good six months now and I have yet to break out. And I'm loving it. So what I love about the Farsali, it's like, you know, it's an amazing primer that makes your skin feel nice and glowy and it doesn't make you feel like you want to break out. Great thing. The only downfall to the Farsali, because it is only one full ounce, it is a bit expensive. $54 is a bit much, but is it worth it? Absolutely. For myself, you know, I don't know if it's not worth it for you. And I'm not trying to tell you guys where to go buy it. This is not a type of video where people pay me to talk about shit. I will not get paid for that stuff. I am not down for that. I will tell you my honest truth. And if, you know, like, you don't like my truth, then the door's actually right there. Bye! So anyways, Farsali, $54 at Sephora, amazing. I say, go get it. What I like to use next onto my skin, right before any foundation I put on or any contouring I like to do, I do like to give my skin that glow, that amazing glow. And I love to do it with the new Marc Jacobs Dewy You Dewy Drops. Okay, girl? This is 0.8 ounces, so not bad it's pretty decent and it is for $44 but look at how it glows it's just one little tiny drop oh 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 bitch oh that is that is just crazy clean fingers just go ahead and just let me just get in there like that oh yes oh yeah okay you really like that little nasty How's that looking? It's nice and glowy. But look, compare my hands. So, look at that. Look at that beautiful glow that comes with it and nothing. It's like, hey girl, hey. The smell, oh my God. Kind of has like a nice little coconut smell to it. So it's very like, islandy, beachy. Coconut macaroon. It's nice, I like it a lot, it's really great. It's an amazing product, it is really cute. And you know, we can't, you know, and there's more Marc Jacobs in my bag because I do love his products. He is actually amazing when it comes to makeup. And it's so funny, he was never really into makeup. So it's actually really nice to have someone who's been in the fashion industry, who's been around for so long, to make a brand of makeup like Fenty, like, like to push it out there, to put it the worth of amazing product. So for me, this Dewey is a worth it. As before, I was thinking about how Fenty, how Rihanna came and she changed up the game. For a brand that just made a scene, she has the most foundations ever released from literally the whitest person in the world to the darkest girl who I've seen their reviews 
where this girl is she's like i had to mix so many foundations to get to my skin color and she's like fenty changed that for her and i like that a lot as you can tell i am wearing fenty right now and i do love my fenty i just love it so i don't even use that much and that's the great thing i use about four to five drops and i don't think that's much really for you know when you're using foundation especially a full coverage foundation like this and it's a mattifying foundation and i have both oily and dry skin and it's look look at this look how beautiful i am i actually reviewed this recently in my last video which will be linked down below so check it out and check out all my videos because Obviously, you're here to see me, and y'all love me. Next off would be my contouring style. I don't go less than nothing but the best. And of course, I go with Anastasia Beverly Hills. You can tell that where I use my contouring. Let's get a little close in there. Right here. I'm about to hit pan. And you know the funny thing is, you would think that they have these little holes right here where you could pop it out and you could get a new pair. But no, people at Macy's and Nordstrom said, sorry, Anastasia doesn't sell them by themselves. So I have to go buy it myself a new fucking thing. <sighs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Composure is back. After I am done contouring my skin, I do like to take a powder bronzer onto my area where I have contour nice and deep to give it that little bit of glow. And none other than Elsie Cosmetics New Bronzer in Medium. You guys, this bronzer is everything. Can we all see that right there? It's really fun. Again. Elsie Cosmetics, Makeup by Lilith's Company, Medium. Really great. I bronzed myself today earlier, and I like the way it feels. This product is $30, and they're actually really great. They're actually 0.31 ounces, which is actually pretty nice for a good pan. And I'm saying it's really nice. It has a nice little touch to it. Let me just put my nice clean finger there, and look at that. Sorry, I'm off to trying to flip you guys off. but And then let's just put it on my hand really quick. Look at that bronze. Really nice. Anyway, so that is for what I use for bronzer. Next up in my beautiful bag of tricks, I love to do my eyes. I love to make my eyes. Your eyes are the windows to your face. What I like to prep my eyes with before I put on any shadow, anything at all onto my eyelids, it is the MAC painterly it goes for $22 at MAC cosmetics it is 0.17 US ounces and honestly I don't use anything other than this every time I prep my eyes with it my shadow never cracks everything looks amazing and I really think it's actually one of the best eye primers ever used on my lids and I've used a couple before and this is actually the one that has stuck by me and you can tell that I use a lot, like it's about to like come out of its areas. <laughs> but anyways, I'm gonna close now. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Back to the bag. Androgyny. I know. I know. I know. I I I know what you're gonna say. Yes, I'm obsessed with him. But he makes it work. He makes it work. Like, look at these eyes, bitch. He makes it work. And let's just talk about pigment. Let's talk about colors. Yeah, obviously, his colors are a bit out there. But a lot of his colors are not. Like, look, right now, I'm just wearing... I have Safe Word and Frosting. And look at that. Let me get a little closer. You guys take a little, nice little glue to it. So... Can't blame me. And with that drudge palette, you can find it on jeffreestarcosmetics.com or you can actually even even find out Morphe brushes, which is great. But anyways, it is $45. And I think it's actually pretty great because you do get... You get 10 pans full of beautiful colors. And it comes with a mirror too. And it's pretty heavy, so it's nice. I say get it. And if you don't have it, you're missing out.
What I like to mattify my skin with and my to set my foundation with is none other than the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. Laura Mercier. This bitch is amazing, okay? You know what? You get what you pay for. And Laura Mercier is actually an amazing brand that has fabulous foundation, fabulous translucent powders, fabulous everything. I haven't used everything in their stuff, so we'll see what happens. One day, maybe I'll just buy the entire collection and then I'll do a review for you bitches. With the Laura Mercier translucent powder, you can find it at Sephora. You can actually find it anywhere that carries Laura Mercier. And it's $38 and it is one ounce. That's actually pretty great for a translucent powder because it does come with a lot of lucent. <laughs> and it's really nice. It sets nicely. And then after you just swipe away, like look at that. Like look at all the matte fine finishes that you have underneath your skin. It's really nice. It sets it nicely. And Come on, let's, let's be honest. It's Laura Mercier. And the French always make really great things. Mm -hmm. And of course, to give myself this glow, okay? Okay? I do love. And you know what? I don't give a flying shit what people say. Oh, you're thirsty for him. Oh, you think you like his brand a lot because what? No, I know good products and his products are amazing. Don't get me wrong. I have hundreds of highlighters and I'm obsessed with all the highlighters I do have because I know good highlighters. I don't go off because, oh, it's Kylie. I hate the Kylie highlighters. I like amazing pigment. Like for me personally, this is it. And it's gonna be the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Peach Goddess. You guys, come on, like, you can't sit there and tell me that it's not a maze balls. Just one swipe. I'll show you the thing. Look at that. And then look at my finger. And go over here again one time. Look at the glow. Look at that glow. It's amazing. It's all over my cheeks. It's all over my nose. I just retails at twenty nine dollars. You can get it at JeffreeStarCosmetics.com, or you can even get it like at, like I said, Morphe brushes. But it is one of the best highlighters I've ever used because look at that. It's like a really beautiful champagne color. It's not too crazy. It's not too much, and it's just a very nice glow on people. But it is pigmented and it's blinding and it's everything. So what I do after I've done my highlighter and I've done my eyes and I've done everything that is, I'm completed with, I do like to hit these brows. Because you know with brows, after you put foundation on, it gets right in the brow. You do eyeshadow, it gets on the brow. So you want to make sure that whatever you're done with that whole eye section, you want to make sure that your brows are complete. Because look at these brows. They are on fleek. I have to say, I do I have some amazing ass brows. And I do like to use the Goof Proof Brow Pencil from Benefit. Excuse me. My fat is jiggling low. Look at that. It's a nice, it's great. It's everything. You can easily just fix yourself up ish and just look at for a guy. <laughs> Goof proof. Brow pencil. Benefit retails at $24. You can find it at any benefit. You can find it at benefit stores in San Francisco, which I think is like my favorite thing to do because you get to go in there and you can see all the benefit products. But I don't live in San Francisco, I live in Los Angeles. So I gotta go to Sephora. But it's worth it, I like it. You know, I think I like it more actually than the Anastasia pencils, personally, because the way it just like nicely glides onto your skin. And you don't have to even use a lot, just very little. So yeah, well worth that. And of course, you know, sometimes, you know, when you're having a look, you wanna have a nice little black eyeliner. And for me, the black eyeliner is none other than the Marc Jacobs Beauty. I told you, bitch. I told you there was gonna be another Marc Jacobs product in my, in my bag. And it's the eyeliner pencil. Dude, let me just tell you. Ooh, daddy, just like pots. So with the Marc Jacobs, let me just show you guys how nice and pigmented it is. I'm gonna just do one little quick down. Look at that. It is really nice. And the way it looks into my waterline, it's fabulous. 
with the Marc Jacobs eyeliner. It is $25. Yes, you know, his products are a little bit pricey, but like I said, his products are very worth it. The way, like, look at that. That is just one swipe, boo-boo. And look at this eye. Like, look at that pop. Cut. He's worth it. Talk later. So, anyways, for me to get my lashes this way, because, you know, I do have natural lashes. I'm kidding. <laughs> These are fake as fuck. <laughs> I do like to use only one thing and one thing only for my lashes. Even when I'm not wearing lash my falsies, which I'm, you know, I'm not a really big fan of falsies because like I said, in my, think, in my second video, I am blessed with long lashes and <clears throat> I like to use Benefit. Of course, yet again, because Benefit makes some really great products too. So, Roller Lash Mascara. It is really nice. It is like, hold on. Look at that right there. Look at that. It's like the way you can go up, the way you can go down. It's really nice. And I think it's a really good product in there too. Um, how many ounces are you? It is 0.30 ounces, which is really great. It retails for $24. You can find it at the Benefit store. You can go to any Sephora and they do have a Benefit there. So. Absolutely, just you should get it. It's really nice. It makes your lashes go whew. Look, I'm telling you right now. I'm kidding. <laughs> These are fake the Products I like to use on my face to set my foundation to Blend my eyeshadow to do a lot of things that like, you know, this highlighter though, okay? The Gilded Collection the Gilded Collection brushes are my all-time favorite brushes from any brand and hey I bought a lot of brushes okay I've actually just recently just did the review on the Spectrum Marine Girl brushes but nothing beats my Morphe brushes and in the Gilded Collection you get 23 brushes for 160 dude that is like nothing that's actually really 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 great because you get a lot of I don't actually have all 23 right now in my hand because I would have been like flopping over and like they've like fallen <laughs> but the ones I usually most with are my blending brushes, my highlighter brushes, my foundation brush, my swipe away brush, and my bronzer brush. These brushes are amazing. I do suggest that if you do want to try a really great brand, especially if you know you're just going into makeup, like how I was about a year and a year ago, I would only like to get Morphe because they're affordable and they're really great, and I just like them a lot. So anyway, so that's Morphe, and of course, to what to use for foundation and of course for my translucent powder are my beauty blenders look how adorable they are beauty blender 20 bucks it's not that bad because you know you can get a lot of bang for your buck with these and these are really great anyways so beauty blenders 20 bucks you haven't heard from them then you live under a rock you need to come out of that, boo-boo. And of course, we all need that setting spray. That setting spray to set us off to the next level. And that's gonna be the MAC Prep and Prime, girl. Fix Plus. Oh. Mm. Mm. Yes. Oh, and it smells so great. $25, you do get 3.4 US full ounces. Dude, that is a cologne. That is, that's actually a really nice cologne. Yeah, I have cologne. I'm sorry. It's, that is cologne. Okay, that's the size of a bottle of a cologne or a perfume. So that's not bad, 3.4 ounces, and you're getting for 25 bucks, but this is to set your face and make you look pretty. Okay. I think there's one thing that we, you guys are probably like, oh, what happened? Why doesn't he talk about this? Why is he not doing this? And it's about my lipstick. My favorite lipsticks in the entire world right now, for the longest time, are the oh, Jeffree Star Cosmetics Lip Velour Liquid Lip. Honey, let me just tell you, this is not my collection. I have so much from his collection right now. I have his first summer collection. I have his second, I have his second Christmas collection. I have his Chrome summer collection. I have all the colors in the original thing. I have it all. I am a lipstick 
Hoa. And there should be two. Like, look at these colors. These colors are really pretty. These colors are everything. The quality of the lipsticks are really amazing. The fact that they're mattifying is just really nice. Um, they are kiss proof, so you know, you can just make out with your boo. I don't have a boo, so I can't really make out with anyone right now. Yeah. They're very long lasting, and they range actually really great price wise. They're $18, and you do get a nice little liquid you know, look right here. Look at this like, prettiness. And they're 0 0.19 fluid ounces, and I think it's actually really great for a liquid lip because you're doing, again, your bang for your buck. $18, not bad. Hey, but you know what? When he does his sales, he can drop them down to $15. Or if you ever get to go see him like at IMATS or DragCon or BeautyCon, he does drop his prices. And that's really nice of him to do that for us. I love him. So I do love his lipsticks right now. And right now you can tell on my lips, I'm wearing abused and doll parts, which... You know, I feel like would be a really great combo to put, especially for my nails, because it is a blue. It's not really black if it looks like that in the camera, but they are blue. And I think it's just a really nice combo. Anyways, so. You've emptied out my bag, you guys. I have nothing in my bag. Those are the products that I use to make this face glow and look sickening. Beat for the gods, and I am ready for you. Thank you guys for coming. Thank you so much for watching my video. Best believe you're going to slap that like button right before you head out. And don't forget, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe down below. And yes, I'm happy that y'all can come and watch me. And it just makes me really happy that I can share like how I get ready with you guys or products I can review. And you know, if you have any ideas on what kind of videos I should do next, link it, tell me down below in the comments. And I think that's really great. Bye, like, you know what?